The second method utilizes both the x and y intercepts. In this method, we do not need to rewrite the equation. In this example, we will use the original equation 3, x minus y equals negative 2. Using this equation, we shall then identify both the x-intercept and y-intercept. To find the x-intercept, we shall solve for the value of x when y is 0. To do this, we shall substitute 0 to y, and we will get x equals negative 2 thirds. Therefore, the x-intercept is negative 2 thirds 0. In the same way, to find the y-intercept, we let x be equal to 0 and solve for y, and we will get y equals 2. Therefore, the y-intercept is 0, 2. We finally have two points which correspond to the x and y-intercepts, negative 2 thirds, 0, and 0, 2. By connecting these points, we are able to graph the linear equation 3x minus y equals negative 2. So class, as we can see, whichever method, we come up with the same line.